Are you prepared to stay? Oh, we won't stay long. I mean, uh, she has to resume work soon, and I have to get back to work as well. So we we'll stay a couple of weeks, a couple of days, like some matter of fact, and we come back. Bye, bye, you. Yes, okay. All right. Thank you. Bye, bye. 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 Lovely wedding, my dear. Without you, I don't know what I would have done. Thank you. Yeah? And you, you guys were so wonderful. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. I you know, appreciate everything. Um, Collins, sir, leave this car here. You know, pack it very well for me. I don't need the other one. So tell the drivers to take the cars to the house. Okay? Yes, All right, sir. Thank you very much. Thank you. All right, take care. Okay. They'll drop you off. Welcome, my sister. All these things. Key. Yam. Oil. Everything. Now, welcome. Good afternoon, my brother. You already prepared for this visit. I thank God, my sister. Everybody will know that you visited. Of course. I know my son. You see all these things? Mm -hmm. He will just give them out to all his friends and colleagues. <laughs> <laughs> Don't even be surprised that he must have announced this my visit. My sister, you can't stop him. God has created him to be nice. And so shall <sighs> blessings upon blessings continue to come his way in Jesus' name. Amen. Please, my sister, greet him and his beautiful wife for me. I will. Tell them to continue to live in peace. Oh. Yeah? <laughs> I will. Wow. Please help me put these things in the car. Oh? Okay. How is your family? Uh -huh. Hey! Uh -huh. Hey! 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 Oh, uh, you will help me lock my gates. No the padlock is there. Okay. Uh, so oh, my sister, bring your husband for me. Oh, oh? Thank you. 
and the children. Wife. Mama, they are not yet back from work. Till this time? Is that the way they walk? Mama, they will soon come back. Hey, God is their strength. I'm so tired. Mama, let me put water for you to take your bath and then some food. That is very nice of you, my dear. But, my dear, collect my bag from the gate man first, oh? Okay, ma. Thank you. Mama, he's very fine. He'll soon be back from work. Hey. hey, have you had anything to eat, Mama? Yes. Eh? My daughter, what are you waiting for? I don't understand what you're talking about, Mama. You're not yet pregnant. Mama, why now? Very soon. Hmm? Very soon. At God's time. Hmm? Mama, let me go upstairs and change. I'll join you very soon. Mama, please, eh? I'll come back to you. Tell me all those stories, oh, okay? Hi. Hi. Oh, God. Hey. I don't want to believe both of you are still playing around. You should be expecting a baby by now. Oh. Honestly, I was hoping to see nothing less than six months old pregnancy. What is the problem? Mama, there is no problem. There is no problem. Absolutely none. In fact, very soon it will happen. Very soon, Robinson. How soon? This is almost 10 months after your wedding. Uh-uh, Mama. There's still time now. Mm -hmm. Very soon, don't worry. By the grace of God, it will be on its way. Oh, yes. I know why I'm saying this. If there's any problem, please, you can talk to me. I am your mother. Mama, there please. is no problem. None whatsoever. My dear, is there any problem? No. You see, there's no problem. Enemies are wicked. They are wicked. But I promise to go the extra mile for solution. Ah. Mm hmm Mama, it hasn't come to that yet. Please. Believe us when we say that we are okay. It's only God that knows the reason why. I mean, it's delaying. Only Him. By the way, have you seen a doctor? No. We haven't. I mean, we, we don't just consider it enough pressing problem to go run into our doctor. That's why. My children, please. Please. I want you to see a doctor. If not for anything, let him confirm you're okay. Please do it for me. Okay. It's all right. Relax. We'll, we'll see our doctor. 
but I can assure you that we are okay. By the way, how is everybody at home? They were okay when I left them. From the result of various pap smear tests conducted, both of you are medically fine. There's nothing absolutely wrong with you. Thank you, Doctor. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. I mean, I appreciate this good news, even though I, uh, we had the feeling that we are all okay. Now, if I may ask, Doctor, if we are medically fit, as you just said, and your test concluded, why then is there delay in conception? Perhaps you've not applied the right timing or positioning, but not to worry. I want two of you to see me tomorrow for a brief gyno tutorial. I'm sure you've properly applied everything will be okay. Tomorrow then, we'll be here. But what time do you want us to come? Two to be precise. Two p.m. Thank you very much, Doctor. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much, Doctor. Thank you so much. Uh, congratulations in view. Thank you. <laughs> so troubled that up till now Vera has not been able to get pregnant and they are not doing anything about it though. I've complained about that each time I visit them. They continue giving me hope. That hope is not fulfilling. It is about time we came to their rescue. Uh, how may we help them? How? Well, um, I know some people who handle cases like that. I think I have to talk to one of them. If possible, collect some herbs. Provided it works. I mean support. I support you. Our own will not be different. It has worked for so many people. Even God knows how long we have waited to carry our own grandchildren. Eh? In law. You will hear from me in four days. Please. It's all right. And if you want me to accompany you, I will follow you. You don't need to worry. Hmm? I will go alone. In fact, I will be leaving. Oh, but you have to keep this drink for next time. Uh, hmm? uh, uh, <laughs> oh, come on. Oh, thank you. Okay. Bye-bye. <laughs> Bye. Bye. I hope it will work. Good. My daughter, yes, take this. Mm -hmm. Drink it every morning before breakfast. Mm -hmm. And uh -huh. and this after meal. This one. These are dried roots. Dried roots. They are what? Dried roots. Morogu. Oh, morogu. Uh, take it. Chew one three times daily. 
true. Yes, true. It's highly medicinal, though slightly bitter. Hmm? And um, drink these one spoon each before you sleep. Oh? Yes, sir. Both of you should take it accordingly, okay? For positive results. Hmm? It's all right, Mama. Thank you, Mama. Thank oh, you so much. Oh, my. Uh, my dear, you take them inside. As a matter of fact, keep them in our bedroom. By the grace of God, with these helps, everything will be all right. I hope they work, Mama. They I, will. I, I hope they work. <laughs> Why not, my son? Eh? With the help of God, these helps will do the magic. Oh, yes, you are my son. You will have your own children. I know. I know. And uh, I want you to know that I appreciate all your effort, Mama. that you are interested in these things. I mean, they are fetish and they may be poisonous too. Please. Listen, I... I didn't want my mother to feel that I didn't like these things because if she knew, she would be upset. And I don't want her to be upset. Okay? Now take them to the dustbin. Darling, please. Please, let's just do as she has said. Please. It's not as if I believe in those things, but you can never tell. Besides, I don't want Mama to be upset if she finds out we've thrown those things away. You don't even know what concoction they are. You don't. Are you trying to say Mama could poison us? No, I'm not that. Ma no. Darling, please. Let's just do it, please. Be cool. Please. Thank you. Continue to cry every day. 
close to you? <sighs> Sorry, darling. I don't know what else to do. I'm very confused. Everywhere I go, people laugh at me. I don't know why I can't call him like my fellow women. Why? I don't know what is wrong with me. Fair enough. No, no, listen to me. Nothing is wrong with you. You are fine. You're absolutely fine. The doctor even confirmed it. You see, all we need now is a little more patience and the good Lord will surely remember us at his own time. Okay? Who would that time be? Where would that time be? For how long will we continue to wait? How long? Listen, Vera. You don't question God. You don't question. That is why he is God. Okay, you and I have waited for five years. But well, those five years might as well be five days in God's own eyes. So, don't lose hope. And never, never give up your faith in God. Now, you go to sleep, okay? Come down. Come down, right? Banking work now, you know how it is. Of hmm. course, it's not easy. We are looking good. Thank you very much. Where are you heading to? I'm just going to my tailor's place down the road. Really? All right, Vera, we'll meet at the salon by this weekend. I hope you will come home. Oh, definitely. I need to do my pedicure. It's been long. Hmm. Um, Are you guys going my way? I could drop you off. No, no, no. Actually, we're waiting for somebody. Waiting for somebody. You're sure? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Bye-bye. All right, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Take care. Yeah, bye-bye. In this life, what goes around surely comes around. How do you mean? There is every speculation that she must have lived a very bad and dirty life. Otherwise, what could have been holding her from being pregnant all these years? My sister, people are even suspecting that the husband used her womb for money-making rituals. Can't you see how excessively rich they are? Yet no child. My dear, everybody should bear his own cross, so... To their tent. Oh, Israel. Oh, oh my sister. Thank you. 
like this. Oh, it's really nice. I want nice. to buy them for myself. It's really nice. It's a puppy. It's very good. Thank you. Very good. For me, what? what I said? No, I picked them for myself. <laughs> what did she say? I wonder who she's buying them for. <laughs> I wonder. Is there anything the matter? No, just pack everything for me. Let me go. not rested all these years, but I thank God that the solution is near. I visited a spiritual wizard who confirmed that your wife is being tormented by Obanje spirit, and that has been responsible for her inability to conceive. Mama, my daughter, it is true. It is true. The earlier you get separated from these people, the better for you. And for all of us. Time waits for no one. You are not getting any younger. Mama, me. Mama. How can you believe I'm an Awanji? My daughter, I don't mean to hurt you. But how can I doubt the words of the gods? They see beyond human existence, you know. Mama, so you had to go to that extent? <sighs> what do you expect of a mother? A troubled mother for that matter. I cannot sleep or think about my children. Eh? Vera, you must leave that your banking work to come to the village for at least four days. Or don't you want to be free from them and bear your own children? Robinson, what do you have to say in this matter? Well, I have heard all that you said, and uh, I'll discuss with my wife. Uh, please do. All I'm saying is just for her to come home on Saturday, and we'll do it once and for all. Good night, Mama. Good night. Don't let that upset you. Me. Okay? Don't worry. <laughs> God. Vera. It's alright. How? Calm down, okay? Oh, my 
and children. Oh, Mama, eh? we are fine. We are mm -hmm. doing just fine. Uh, any positive news? Nothing yet, Mama. Uh, well, Mama, like my wife just said, there is no positive news in that regard as at now. But my mother was here a couple of days ago, and she said that... She, she said what? Eh? Well, she said that she consulted a spiritual wizard back home, and he revealed that my wife had been tormented all these years by very powerful or burning spirits. And that's why she's not been able to have children. So my mother wants her to come back home to perform some, well, some kind of exorcism, you know, rituals. To fear what? She said that? Yeah, that was what she said. Years ago, when people blindly believed in that, eh? they are mere superstition, and it doesn't work. It doesn't. And even if anyone needs deliverance, it must be in the church, not any deity at all. No, I don't. I don't support that. I don't. Oh, I said I it. Not. Honey, was your mother here when I told you that I'm not in support of that? You see, there's no way I can allow my wife to go through any exorcism. You know, I know, I can't take that. <laughs> what is this? Why is this happening to me? Why? Why? If I had my own children, would anybody come to disturb me with issues like this? Stop crying. God, why? Why? Stop Piccolo? crying. Stop crying. What did Vera do? Stop crying. Eh? Mama, I'm tired. Stop crying. I'm I know the God. I know the thing. God I'm serving. I know the God I'm serving. He's not asleep. He will do it in his own time. Haven't you got faith? God. Have you forgotten Sarah in the Bible and Elizabeth? I wonder. Have you? And you are crying. Stop crying. be held responsible afterwards. Whatever solution anyone brings, I am ready to follow. All I want to do is to have my own children. How else do you want me to explain it to you? And I insist that you go nowhere. Get that straight into your head. You've been to so many places, done so many unimaginable things to have children, yet they refuse to come for this one. Oh no, I won't allow my wife to be part of any ritual. So you take that bag straight to our room and that's it. Just listen to yourself. You don't know how it feels because you're not the one wearing the shoes. The shoes you wear are not different from the one I wear. So why do you have to go around announcing your problem to all and sundry? Why? You are not the only one who doesn't have children, are you? Robinson. Me. What problem am I announcing? Don't just upset me. Did you hear that? I'm sorry. Uh... Listen, honey, I, I'm sorry, okay? I, I didn't mean it that way. I love you, okay? I didn't mean to upset you. Please try and reason with me on this one. Please, I'm sorry. I am sorry to disobey you for the very first time. I've made up my mind and I have to go. Oh, 
Just open your arms in readiness to receive the fruit of your own womb. I pray so, Mama. I really pray so. It will be so, my dear. I want to thank you for your patience and obedience in doing everything you were instructed to do. Thank you. This is well. Even the Bible in the book of Matthew chapter 7 verse 7 says that if you seek, you shall find. We will get it in Jesus' name. Amen. Let me start going. Oh. Bye bye. All right. Ah! What is it? Cat. Ah. I wonder why there are so many people. I almost stepped on it. It's okay. Ah. It's okay. It's okay, my dear. Thank you. Oh. Thank you. Save. Yes, Mama. Thank you. Mm. Bye-bye. My people, I greet you once more. Ah, thank you. You see, we've been sitting around here for quite a while now, and uh, nobody's saying anything. All I see are people murmuring and whispering to one another. Can somebody tell me why I was asked to come home? Eh?
I don't like this silence for one thing. Because it will seem as if one is afraid of somebody here. Robinson, we invited you home to ask you why you have used your wife's womb for money ritual. She naked. Don't you want to have your own offsprings? Man, shut up, don't call me. So, you all sat down together to conceive this terrible and evil thought. God, God, I never knew. Never had an inkling that you hated me all these years. All of you. Mazi. So you had the guts to open your mouth to vomit that rubbish. What rubbish? I've told you the fact. And that's the truth. Otherwise, why can't she have her own children? May I balance the seal that your mouth. You fool. A drunk like you who does not even know his left from his right. Who are you to, to have a say in my family affair? We know that it is your family affair. But bear in mind that what you are enjoying is blood money. All of you. All of you swear one by one that you have not in any way benefited from the said blood money. No, I have not. Shut up! Eh? God punish you then. Mumwa Rose. Who says you have not? Sit down! Yeah, Zara, get up! Nah, get up! Go home! I have ah. nothing to say to all of you. Who says? Except one thing. <sighs> Thank you very much. So this is why like you I brought know. my son back home. Like we get fools. Come back home! How am I sure that you are not even part of the problem? Enter your car and drive off. Rosanna. Don't resign me. Don't resign me. Enter the car. That's why you people invited us for this meeting. Come on, get out. Enter the car. That's why you. No, sir. Why? Will you leave this place? Go, ah, join them. Join them. Ah, leave my son alone. Don't come close to my son again. We get fools. I'm disappointed in you people. We are disappointed in you. We are disappointed in you. We had a meeting and then we are telling us about it. Go! Go! Hey, 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 hey. Go, go, go. Foolish old man. My gate is open, no? My gate is open. When you finish gossiping, you can Rosa, go. Let's listen. You will not come. Let us settle You will look for us and let's grind. Chile, you will look for us and let's grind. Chile, you will look for us and let's grind. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. that cat. I hope not. I certainly hope not. <laughs> that was close. Shipping in iniquity and in sin did our mothers conceive us. Behold, thou desirest truth in the inward part, and in the hidden part thou shalt make us to know wisdom. Purge us with hyssop, and we shall be clean. Wash us, and we shall be whiter than snow. Make us to hear joy and gladness that the bones which thou hast broken may rejoice. Hide thy face from our sins and blot out all our iniquities. Create in us a clean heart, O God, and renew a right spirit within us. Cast not us away from thy presence, and take not thy Holy Spirit from us. Restore unto, your, unto us the joy of thy salvation, and our tongue shall speak our God of thy righteousness. 
O oh Lord, open thou our lips, and our mouth shall show for thy praise. For thou desirest not sacrifice, else we will give it. Thou delightest not in burnt offerings. The sacrifices of God are a broken spirit, a broken and a contrite heart. O oh God, thou wilt not despise. Do good in thy good pleasure unto Zion. Build thou the walls of Jerusalem. Then shall thou be pleased with the sacrifices of righteousness, with burnt offering and whole burnt offering. Then shall we offer bullocks upon thy altar. In Jesus' name. Amen. Let us pray. Heavenly Father, we give you thanks. We bless you, Thank name, you. God. We adore you, Lord. We worship, we worship you, God. Almighty Father. We bless Father, you, Lord. We know God. that you are standing. Father, we thank you, our Lord Father, God, because it is our, our God, if it, it is our confidence in you that you will reward, O oh Lord God. God. Father, O oh Lord we God, for your grace as we stand today, Jehovah, we ask, O oh God, for your hand of mercy to rest upon us. Jehovah, Lord God Almighty, O Lord God, you said in your word that none amongst us will be barren, O God. Father, O Lord God, we stand and we stand on that word. Plead it, Jehovah, let it be fulfilled in our midst in the name of Jesus. Clean oh, our tears. Let us sing, O oh God, to but your God, name and say that you have done a good thing in our midst, Jehovah. That tomorrow they will know that you are a good God. Father, that when people look at us, they will know that you are a good God and that you believe it. Oh your children. Jehovah, bless us, O oh God. Father, for how long shall we continue to wait? Have mercy upon us, O oh God. Jehovah, we ask for you because you're the only one that we are. I'm glad to see you happy these days, you know. No more sadness, no more sorrows, no more frowning and all of that. It hasn't done anything for me over the years, so I've just learned to live each day as it comes. And that's good. That's really good. <laughs> I hope you're still traveling with me, because it's already summer. I'll fly anywhere with you, my darling. That's my wife. That is my wife. <laughs> Just you wait until we get there. I'll give you a treat of a lifetime you will never forget. I trust you. <laughs> Eat your food. Of course I'm eating. Congratulations, madam. Congratulations for what, doctor? You are six weeks pregnant. Doctor, are you sure of what you're talking about? This is a test result.
it, it's, it's wonderful. It, like I, I always tell people, if you know who to contact and the right places, then um, things are relatively easy to be done in, in this country. You know what, Tony? Let's meet later. I'll buy you a drink for your birthday. And, um, I'll, and I'll call you back, okay? I'll call you back. Yeah. Just look at this. Take a look at this. What is the whole excitement? Just about? take a look at it first. Right. Quickly. Tell me, tell me first. Oh my god. It is very true. The doctor says I am six. This is wonderful! I can't believe yes. this. Better believe it, darling. Oh my god. This is just <laughs> you. Where do you want to have a baby? London, Spain, Paris, Tokyo, New York, China, Abuja. <laughs> no. No. Oh, of course, America. Oh my God! This is this is this is this is this Finally. Finally. <laughs> Mama, welcome. Glory be to God, my son. Mama, let me have oh. your bag. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> How are you? Fine, Mama, welcome. Uh, How was your trip? It was fine. How is everybody? Everybody talking? is fine. Welcome. Glory be to God. Yes, Mama, he has done I it. I knew he would do it for me. He has done it. Hey! <laughs> It's like you people are dressed to go to church. Oh, yes, Mama, we are going to church. Eh? Yes. There is no point going inside. Let us all go to church and praise God. <laughs> Bring it. No, Mama, let me carry the bag. Eh? Uh, but how can I even let you carry anything? Give me! Oh, Mama. Abota, look at Enter. Abota, look at This my baby, oh, oh, my very yeah. soon. Ah, hey. oh. I hope the doctor oh. has advised you on what to do and what not to do. Yeah. What to do? Not eat anything that is very peppery, oh. or very hot. Oh. You must not carry anything that is heavy because of your waist. Yeah. You must eat plenty of fruits. Vegetables. Drink plenty of water because it will help to nourish your body. <laughs> mm. And um, if you feel 
you are overworking yourself. Just take a leave and rest. If possible, let the leave start now until you put to bed. Eh? <laughs> Mama, it's not possible. But I've heard all you have said. I'll do everything. Don't worry, I'll be fine. Okay. What will you like to eat? Let me prepare it. Nam nukwa for ma. Mama, I'm not hungry. When I'm hungry, I'll let you know. Okay. How is the baby doing? Fine. I can't wait. I really can't wait. Your traveling papers are ready, my dear. You'll be leaving for the United States of America in the next two weeks and probably stay back there until you deliver. I am not in support of that. Oh, Mama, you scared us. When did you enter? How would you know when you're carried away? By love. <laughs> Welcome, Mama. <laughs> nah. um, How are you? I'm fine. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. I got you. <laughs> Welcome. <gasps> hey. Hey, we. Hey. Robinson. Mama. I heard when you were telling your wife that she will be traveling to America to have the baby. Oh, yes, I... Uh, uh, she's not going anywhere. I want her to stay here and have the baby. So that I'll be around her to take care of her. Moreover, I'd like to put to bed here. Mm. Let people see me actually give birth to my own baby. It's not when I travel and come back now, they'll say I went to adopt a child. Me, I don't want that. <laughs> I don't really understand why both of you are thinking like that, but... If that's what you want, okay. Mama, what would you like to eat? There's bitter leaf soup, draw soup. We also have rice with curry sauce. Which one would you want? My daughter, don't worry. When I'm hungry, I will serve myself. Hmm? This kind of relaxation is what you need now. Hmm? But um, once in a while, you take a walk around the premises as a form of exercise. Oh? Oh. I need some water to drink. Linda! Linda! Get Mama some water to drink, Biko. Nah, I will walk. Oh, Mama, we're just doing fine. We thank God. Thank God, though. My dear, you heard what Mama just said about exercise. So, Let's take a walk. Let's go for the walk. Mm. <laughs> Welcome. Uh, Mama, just make yourself comfortable. This is my house. Of course it is. <laughs> <laughs> London with your husband. When did you come back and buy the two to deliver them? How news flies, Jimmy. No, 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 no. As a matter of fact, my husband saw you people at the international airport. Oh. 
he traveled same night. Unfortunately, he was rushing not to miss his flight. Mm -hmm. He couldn't wait to greet you before. Mm -hmm. Just look at you. Hey, well, I traveled with my husband uh -huh. to go and do some little baby yeah. shopping. Chill out. Yeah. And some other minor shopping for ourselves. <laughs> <laughs> well, my mother in law and yeah. some other family members said okay. I should put to bed here in Nigeria. Okay. That they want to take care of me. Yeah. They said the child I'm carrying is a very precious. Very precious indeed. <laughs> it is well with you, my, my dear. dear. To God be the glory. Ah, God, it is well, my sister. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Yeah. Just don't forget to call me when it will happen. Because uh -huh. I would like to be there. You don't trust me, though. Just keep your ears yeah, to yeah. <laughs> How is your husband? He's fine. All He's right. fine. Let me pay him. Okay, take care of the All right, take care. Baby, okay? All right. All right, now. Oh, my God. Thank you. Matter of fact, the president has approved. I'm going to Abuja the day after tomorrow. It, uh, yes, to tidy up things. I, I owe you one, I know. Yes. All right then. Good night. So, so business. <laughs> My dear, of course, I work for you and, and the baby. <laughs> well, that reminds me. I forget. The doctor said he would like to see both of us tomorrow. The doctor? Yes. Why? I, I, I hope there's no problem. None that I know of. You know it's been long you went there with me. So he said he would like to see you. Though he sounded very important anyway. Mm. Tomorrow? Mm. Okay. we see him tomorrow then. Mm. So how was work? Well... As you heard from my conversation, work was wonderful. <laughs> <laughs> but more importantly, how is the baby doing? Put your ear there and find out. <laughs> I hope, I hope he doesn't kick me the way he kicked me the last time. <laughs> wow. Oh, this is wonderful. Do they ever rest in there? What kind of question is that? date is there and chances are that she may not have normal delivery. Uh, if that be the case, we may have to conduct C several section on her to be on the safe side. Ah, madam, you don't have to cry. It's going to be a precautionary measure. I mean, a lot of women have had uh, to deliver through that process. Okay. I never thought I would experience this in my entire life. Why me? God, why me? It's all right, my dear. It's okay. Calm down. The doctor here says that it's going to be all right. <laughs> it's going to be. It's going to be okay. I assure you. But doctor, are you assuring us that everything will be okay? I promise there's not going to be any problem. By God's grace. I'll show it. Why is my case always different? The Bible said we would deliver like Hebrew women. Why would I deliver through his tears? God, why? Why? Stop crying. Stop crying, you're upsetting yourself. The doctor said you will be fine, and I believe him. I've also heard about cases that are not too different from yours, so don't worry, you'll be okay. 
Lady Joma gave birth last week. It was peaceful. Adora gave birth a few months ago. Normal delivery, nothing happened. Patricia told me herself that she didn't even feel the pains of labor. Then why should my own case be different? If I'm not for Anavera, something will happen. Why would my own case be different? Yes. Bye -bye, dear, oh. okay. Don't worry. All I have to tell you now is that God, the same God who started this miracle, will see it to its logical conclusion in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Now. Five hundred thousand naira. Please, doctor, take it. Do whatever you can to save the life of my wife and that of my baby. Please, if there's need for more money, I'll bring it. Please, take back your money, sir. Take back your money. It's quite unprofessional. Very unprofessional. Uh, I assure you, everything is going to be all right. Okay. All you need to do is just to pray for her. Pray for us. Let me get to her. Wait, I, I, I'm coming with you, doctor. I'm coming with you. How is my wife and my baby? How are they doing? Your wife is okay. Uh, and uh, it's okay. And my baby? But unfortunately, we lost the baby. No. No, you just have to take her. Uh, doctor, tell me it's not true. Tell me it's not true. Tell me the baby is alright. Huh? I'm sorry we lost the baby. No, doctor. Thank God your wife is alive. God. That's the most important thing. My baby. My baby. Doctor. Just be the man. Okay. Oh God. Okay. Oh God. Don't 
don't know what we went through. I, I understand how you feel. Just get up. Take heart, my daughter. Stop crying. At least you've proven to the world that you are not barren. God is not asleep. And by the time you know it, another one will come. And the one that will come to see. Hmm? Stop crying. My daughter, it's okay. You have cried enough. Only God knows why things happen the way they do. Because he's the only one that has the master plan of our lives. Let the baby go. And like your mother said, another will come. It's okay. wished to watch you someday playing with these toys like other children. I had so long waited to bathe you with warm water and nourish your skin with precious cream. You did not even taste the milk of your mother's breast. God, why? What have I done to deserve all these? Everything will be fine, okay? And I believe that we will be fine, okay? Please, let's just go ahead and trust God for another baby.
I was in pastoral school when I heard you were pregnant. I was happy and I thanked God. I never forgot you in my prayers. I was hoping that someday I'll come and see you. See me now. Frank has seen me. <laughs> the devil has taken it away from me. No, don't say that. Don't say that. All will be well. But if I may ask you, what is a relationship with God? What else? I read the Bible. I go to church. As much as I know, I'm a child of God. <laughs> Vera, are you born again? I want to tell you the truth. If you're not born again, Vera, you better be. Give your life to Christ. Because that is the only way you may know peace in your life. You have gone through so much in your life. And that is the handwork of Satan. But my Bible tells me, in John chapter 10 verse 10, that the devil came to steal, kill, and destroy. But woe unto him, because today we are going to break those bonds that he has in your life. So that you may begin to possess your possessions. Amen. But first of all, you have to give your life to Christ. Are you ready? It doesn't take much, where it doesn't. Just give your life to Christ. Accept Christ as your personal savior. It doesn't take much and all will be well with you. Okay? Father, I thank you and I bless your holy name for your daughter. I give you all the praise and adoration, Father, King of glory. I commit your daughter into your hands at this hour, King of glory. As she has come into thy presence, O Lord, because your word has said that in the presence of God there is fullness of joy. Father, whatsoever she is going through today, Lord, King of glory, I pray, Lord, that you come and solve it for her in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Pray. Because your word has said, O Lord, cast all your cares and bodies unto me and I will give you rest. But I pray that today you give your daughter rest in the mighty name with Jesus Christ pray. And any power that I'll be fighting against our Father King of Glory that is not from you, Father King of Glory, we destroy them in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. My Lord and my God, King of Glory, I commit her into your hands, O Lord, that O Lord, whatsoever, King of Glory, that have been disturbing her, Father King of Glory, today, Father, we put it to an end in the mighty name of Jesus Christ pray. Amen. Father, Papa, Lord, King of Glory, I pray that you be with her. You take absolute control of our life, O Lord, and our family in the mighty name of Jesus Christ pray. Amen. Father, we thank you. We bless your holy name. Be thou exalted, O Lord, because we know that you have done it for your daughter. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, we pray. Amen. And amen. amen. You see, sister, as the Lord has visited you today, you are now a new creature. All things are passed away and all things are become new. You see, as I was praying, the Lord ministered to me that there is somebody bewitching you for not just cause. But you don't have to worry about it because the battle is the Lord's. Amen. And I encourage you to always pray and be close to God. That His light will shine upon you and upon your household. And whatsoever you lay your hands shall be prosperous. 
and many shall call you blessed, and it shall be well with your soul. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. Amen. Um, Pastor, please. Um, about the prayer and fasting you talked about, what are the prayer points? How do I go about it? I'll give it to you now. Let your living waters flow over our souls. Let your Holy Spirit come and take control of every situation that has troubled our minds. All our cares and burdens unto you. Is pregnant again. There is nothing this God cannot do. Father, you are so good. You are so wonderful. May all adoration, majesty, honor be unto that holy name. Amen. Just are you sure she's not going to kill this one again in our witchcraft for her? I don't feel pity for people like her who don't want unborn babies to come and enjoy the light of this world. Betony, how would you say something like that? Mm. Eh? You don't judge someone so that you won't be judged. Well, that's for me. I'm happy for her. Be happy. Oh, 
Let's hurry up. Let's hurry up. The native doctor gave it to me for your wife, Vera. She has been instructed to tie it round her waist for safe delivery. God forbid. God forbid. Not me, Mama. I will not touch that thing, let alone tie it on my waist. God forbid. Vera, you lie. You lie, my daughter. This is the only thing that will keep that baby in your womb till you deliver. You think I'll just sit and watch you lose it a second time? Hmm. Mama, gone are the days I followed anybody anywhere, looking for help where there is no help. I have found the true light, which is in Christ Jesus. Yes. He's the author and the finisher of my faith. Yes. And in his hands lies every solution to any problem I will have. Hallelujah. I will not touch that thing. God forbid. What are you saying? Hmm. What I am saying is that I do not believe in that thing. Mama. Please, stop going anywhere on my behalf. Biko, I will not touch that thing, no. God forbid. Chiapa. Vera, you're not going to use this. You're not going to use it. Robinson, you're here. Okay. There is no problem. All my efforts are in vain. She need to know how to get me.
doesn't want to help herself. I don't understand. What was the problem now? We got to the point that it, it demands for her to, to be operated upon. But she wouldn't let me. I pleaded with her that at least now that the baby is still alive, let me do it. She can't, she couldn't even give consent to it. Look, I'm tired. I'm tired. I won't go back to that place again. Doctor, 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 please, please. Uh, you, you're the only one I can rely on now. Please, allow me to go to... No, 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 I'm not going to that room again. I beg you in the name of God, doctor, please. Excuse me. You are my only hope now. You are my only hope, Doctor. If you leave me, what will I do? Robinson, I... you don't understand what I am saying. Look, I beg you in the name of God. She doesn't want to help herself. Hey, doctor, please. I'm sorry. Let me talk to her. Please, whatever it takes. I'm sorry. Please, you are my hope. Uh -huh. Can't you understand what I'm saying? I, I, I do. But I've exhausted all the all for, for her to understand me. I, I know, but... Doctor. Please, let me... Doctor, she's been delivered of a baby boy. What? Yes. She's been delivered? Yes, sir. And my wife? Hey, doctor! God, I thank you. I thank you. You have shamed the devil. You have put the devil to shame. God has put the devil to shame. Hey! Me! Now a grandmother! My sister! Now a grandmother! Rose, Rose, you're 
Yes, I forgot to do so. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, hmm? Papa Karu, what are you doing here? <laughs> I've come to see my my daughter-in-law. <laughs> I had she gave that. I know none of you ever care to inform me. Uh, uh, sorry, sorry, we're sorry. Forgive us. Eh? I was waiting for them to be discharged first. Moreover, you were not in the village when I left. Uh. So, how did you get it? I was arrested. Hey, uh, what a long journey you embarked on. Chai. Oh, my daughter. Thank you. Congratulations. Eh? Thank you. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Hey, Mama, what you good at? Hey, 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 Involved in various predicaments. Mommy! Oh, all the evil that has befallen her, including her long years of childlessness, were caused by me. Chimo! 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 Papa Karo! In fact, my mission here was to kill this child. Chimo! It will not happen. On my leg! He doesn't get to my life. Please, please, forgive me. Forgive me, please. You? What's a word of me, please? What's a word of me? My body is burning. Let it burn! My body is burning. That was forever! Papa Karo! Please. You are my late husband's only brother. Please. What have we done to you to deserve these long years of torture? Please, please. Eh? Please. Please. Hey! Please. 
Kakaro. Please. Please. Please, please. Well, um, the much I have known her, she's a good girl. And I think she'll make a good wife. I'm really surprised you're supporting Robinson to get married now. Yeah. <laughs> Papa Karo, how long is he going to wait? He's not getting any younger. Mama Robinson. Mm -hmm. Mama Robinson. Mm -hmm. I hope you are not pushing him to that girl because of the things she buy for you. Mm -hmm. eh? <laughs> you know, women will always have a way of bribing themselves into any family they want. Papa Caro, nobody is bribing anybody. She's just a good girl. <laughs> if you say so. Uh, uh, I hope you understand the role you're going to play as his father's only surviving brother. Oh, what do you want me to do? Uh, well, um, arrangements with regards Marriage introduction, um, bride price, and so on. In short, Robinson will come and see you when he comes back over the weekend. <laughs> no problem. Mm -hmm. oh, thank you. Mm -hmm. I want to go to the market. I will see you when I get back. Ah. Uh, thank you. Oh. Okay. Oh. Go away, eh? Oh. Imagine the excitement, the joy, the smiles on her face, upon her son's word, he wants to marry. And very soon, they will start bearing children. Mbano. No! Robinson must not have it all. Okay, that's the one, man. Walk <coughs> Ask him, this can not what I be a Jew. Ali, the Gakalo Mili. Ije Jabron, one young Ari, Mija Dinke, a blang Ari. I said it is done, and so shall it be forever. Let them get married. Don't even try to stop them. Until the end of their lives, they shall lack children. Barrenness has already befallen them. <laughs> hey, Vienna. Rub the substance I gave to you on your body, on your wedding day. 
and you must make sure you embrace both of them. She must never be pregnant. And if, even if she does, eventually, the baby must not see the light of the day. Uchichi, Uchichi. Oh, come on. Uchichi, what are you doing? Oh, God, oh, God, come on. Can you even be ready? Oh, you're buying an angus. Angus in daily. You've always come to my head. Um, what of the cat you made mention? Do you still need it? Yes. Of course, yes. You must bring it before sunrise tomorrow. I am going to transform you with the spirit of the cat. And as clever and sharp as the cat is, so you shall become to execute the mission you desire at all times without your back touching the ground. Abe Luana. Abe Luana. Agwano na wuchan wuchu se lisa ne liye mwa. Kubeje doba logolo. Oga ta ade kwa me. Uchichi. I'm so grateful. I don't know how to thank you. You are welcome. Thank you. Iwa wanaka. Ejiru gebe kliye. Thank you. So I will see you later, huh?